Welcome back Guardians, Profane here, thanks for checking out the video. One of the most difficult things about the new Zero Hour exotic mission is trying to complete all of the symbols, switches, and puzzles while under the constraints of a very strict time limit. And if you're attempting it solo, that time can quickly start running thin when you have to run through those puzzle areas and handle that long boss encounter by yourself. On its normal mode, you get 40 minutes, but on Legendary, you only get 20. And it's only on its Legendary mode that you're able to complete the switch sequences to unlock the Outbreak's Catalyst refits. If you were unaware, there is currently a time glitch that removes the countdown timer, giving you as much time as you need to complete any and all of the symbols, switch, and puzzles and plenty of time to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with that epic boss encounter. It's pretty easy to perform this glitch, and it'll be perfect to use if you're trying to get that solo and solo flawless run. All you need to do is make it past the security wing where the first walker is, defeat all these enemies, and move through the next room. In this room there'll be a big heavy shank. Once the barrier to the doorway has dropped, there will be about 8 to 9 more enemies, including a few invisible vandals. You need to get the amount of enemies down to just one, and then wait out the clock until it strikes to one second. As it transitions from 1 to 0 seconds, defeat that enemy. And if you've timed it out right, you'll now be able to continue on through the mission without any timer. You'll be able to activate all the symbols and all the switches, and you'll have all the time that you need to complete those vault puzzles, and all the time in the world to defeat that boss. With that said, I have encountered scenarios in which the timer does start back, with only one minute left, but that's only after completing the vault puzzles. So if you're only after the solo or solo flawless run, then you don't really have to worry about that. Outside of having to wait upwards of 15 minutes, the only caveat to this glitch is that tomorrow, Bungie has scheduled server downtime that will include maintenance. This very well could see an end to this glitch, so if you haven't had any luck yet getting through zero hour, then you need to be sure to take advantage of this glitch before it gets patched. With that said, I wish you all the best of luck out there in completing the Zero Hour, getting your Outbreak perfected Catalyst refits, and getting that new exotic ship. Thank you as always for checking out the video. If you enjoyed and found it helpful, then be sure to hit that like button below, along with the subscribe button if you're new. Both are greatly appreciated, and both really do help support the channel. If you're a new Light Guardian, just starting your journey, or a battle-hardened veteran, just looking for a new home, then be sure to check out the Discord link in the description below, and join one of the greatest communities in all of Destiny. And until next time, Guardians, this has been Profane, wishing you all some happy hunting.